It's Sunday crunch time again in the Hero Indian Super League. Precious points to play for in Pune today. The informed team with three wins from three. Pune City sit to continue their surge up the table against two-time champions ATK. And the men from Kolkata, they'll be looking for back-to-back -back victories for the first time this season. And uh, let's hope we have a good old game here as we count down to kick off match football, everybody, in Pune. complex you know it's a, you're close to the action there's uh, no running track around which but there's another Steve Cockers comments isn't it it's difficult sometimes in India because you get the big group like Calcutta and Delhi uh, and atmosphere's not easy to transmit from the crowd to the players because they're so far away decent angle for a right foot and maybe more than left foot yes it is stacking it, it was on the rise I tell you that's worked that ball just swerved in flight that's weird movement from the ball it's kicked that and hit that in, in a different way than we've seen anyone hit the ball this season. Pune with a platform. Plenty of players around the 18-yard area. First time shot. And why did they take a little touch out? It was the, the left foot there that dispatched the shot from Diego Carlos. Yeah, been given a different, did. Yeah, been given a different role as well in the team under Phil Brown, hasn't he? As a right wing back. And here they come in number. There is a quintet forward here. There must be a shooting chance. And the keeper scores it and then grabs it at the second attempt. So it was Prime Halbert, who's uh, never scored in ISO. He did have it in hard and low. Been allowed to go forwards as well by the looks of things. So him and Gerson obviously working together. If one goes, one sits. Prime's turn to go on that occasion. Look out. Find it an interesting game. It will be an interesting moment. Crossbar, absolute screamer from outside the area. Well, he's making the mark, isn't he? As soon as he's entered the game, Edu Garcia, here in India, and what a mark he's made on the crossbar. Well, we saw that quality when he was at Bengaluru. I mean, that's just a hard chance, a snapshot. He's absolutely nailed it. He's nailed it too well. Just wonder, though, if the keeper may just have got a finger to that had it been an inch or two lower. Or to the right sort of area, Hume does get a touch on it this time. Another cracking try. Well, it's all action at the moment. The ball is fizzing around, and the efforts are coming in for all around as this one does it again. He's got a good right foot on again. Asking the questions. Only two across in the middle now. And that's a decent in an inviting ball for the shot. What a for Pune City! It took a big deflection, I'm sure, but it is Pune City who had the only advantage here with the big one there against ATK. The one about all smiles. The shot, I'm sure, took the deflection, which was sufficient to leave out that helpless. Well, you can quite clearly see Harita diving to his left hand side. He'll think it was Johnson that plays foot there. Very much still in the game here. It's a deep one, and that's touched the crossbar and the fingers of the goalkeeper at the same simultaneously, I reckon. Kamal Jits kept his concentration well. What a wicked corner that can be. Well, he has scored from a, a corner this season, so far, has he? Oh. I've seen plenty of the ball at the minute. We're halfway through this opening half. There's a very good ball, and he's uh, onside as well. This will be a shot. And oh. will be a screamer of an equaliser. We told you this could be an extravaganza in attacking football terms, and Jayesh Rani has smashed it an absolute beauty here to bring ATK back all square. What a piece of a Kolkata. Well, his last goal, he hit from around 35 yards out, and it absolutely flew in the top corner. This, though, this, he's on site when the ball's played. This is absolutely sublime. Wow! I didn't know he had that in his locker, to be quite honest. He's just dropped the shoulder, created that yard for himself and bent it past everyone into the top corner. That is a stunning strike from Jayesh Rani. As I say, extravaganza. And uh, that one is taken care of, but not very well. And here he goes. Oh, it's the money. Oh, it's well. And I was just going to say it's another either exquisite or another home goal. And Lanz is cursing there because I think he thought it was going in. What's I thought it was. What's going on with this game, John? It's a great ball whipped in, but, you know, I mean, you can let that go. But Sale puts his head there and almost does his own keeper. And everybody was stationary. Oh, another brilliant 
set as well. You just can't take your eyes off this one for a second. And this one is thumped in venomously by the left boot of Marcelino. And the misses we've had tonight have been narrow misses. They haven't been booming yards over the crossbar, have they? They've been scraping over the bar. No, not at all. They have been close. I mean, that's not that far away. I told you everything happens in Pune. Free kick here. Oh, a shot, shot. Oh, just bicycle kick this time, Everton. It deserved a goal, didn't it? He's smiling, we're smiling, everybody's smiling because they're loving the football. I think he's given the offside there, which is why the whistle blew. But again, I think that first one should have been hit goal bang. Once it had been whipped in there from Lanza. Who is it who's popped up? It's Pritam Kotal, who's got to go for goal there. Then it came off Gerson, didn't it? It just bounced off Gerson. Well, that's a lovely acrobatic attempt. You can tell he's Brazilian doing that, can't you? No, but should have hit the target, John. Yep, Gerson's been told to sit. Here he goes again, and he's trying his luck again as well. No problem in the uh, the net for Kamaljet. And it wouldn't surprise me if, if, if Pranay ends up having more shots today than he has done in the whole season. Marcelinho will yeah. deliver into the right area as well. And oh, oh, he's grabbed. Just grabbed her by her down. <laughs> again, anything might have happened there. It's been more wizard time. Someone's booted it. It's hit Johnson in the face, and he's nearly scored a second up goal. <laughs> well, look at this. Looped up from the key for this time, hasn't it? But there it goes. It was Hume, one that was smashed it back oh. against him. I think. Who's it going to be? It's going to be the man in form. It's just over this time. It didn't quite get the dippy need that he got the other day. That was two free kicks last time out, wasn't it? This time, it's it up and over. We just can't get it back down. Just goes to prove that, you know, he is human. And that for certain will be half-time, but what a very good first half that has been. Thoroughly enjoyable. ATK centre-back John Johnson, unfortunately, putting into his own net after a shot from Marko Stankovic. That was in the early phase, but the equaliser from that man, Jaish Rani, there was a beauty. To go by with the first half, we can expect excitement the second, which is good. Certainly is, it's the Stallions against the Bengal Tigers. And it's been uh, very, very entertaining indeed. And, uh, anybody joining us at ATK Arena? It's a chance for Robin Sagan. And there is the save made by Aaron Dam. But the uh, ball is still alive, and Boone still have opportunities. It was pretty well straight at him, but at least Robin in the last match looked as though he might get a goal with a lovely gliding header late on, and he just needs a goal, doesn't he? Once he gets one, he'll get a few more. It was the one that... Uh... First time in, yeah, yeah, yeah. quickly. Yeah. Oh, it's been given a penalty. Penalty given, and Emmett raises his arms in pants. And I think the referee from Jordan, but he's smiling funny enough. Uh, everybody's smiling, but some are smiling in disbelief. Uh, he's smiling because he's won his team a spot kick here. Edu Garcia. Now two, and ATK have turned it around. One down, and now two on ahead. And the smiles, the biggest smile of all, is on the face of Edu Garcia. I think that's a little bit harsh on Pune. I do. We've seen penalties given for that, we've seen it not given. But, as you've said, it's all about interpretation and letter of the law. You tip the arm. Man from Middlesbrough is on his way, on his case. Yes! Corner Pune. Corner yes! Pune! 2-2. And Robinson looks to the heavens because he's got the ball that's been eluding him for so long. 14 months it is since he left Melbourne. But it's a great header from a cracking player. Well, Mr. Singh enjoying that one as well by the looks of things. Well, just... A good catcher. And this gets out as quality to a quality to a And well done to Arinda. Good save, that is. Those shooting boots are back firmly on now from Marsa. He's obviously looked at the players around and they're doing their part. And that sometimes cheers you up. Can we get a winner here? Marcelino's had a lot of attempts and he'll have another one and he's really stretching her and down. But Aaron Dam's been equal to it. 
think I mentioned earlier, he's not conceded more than two in a game this season. He don't want that record to go now. He's at full stretch again there. Same player as well, Rohit Kumar. Kumar. But it, in a way, it's ended appropriately. Uh, VAR would definitely have come into play there, at least twice in the last few moments. But Steve Cooper will shake hands first with Trevor Morgan.